I have 170 games on Stadia and maybe played one third of them. My backlog is massive. Mine's insane. I have 188. I have a fair amount of Stadia games, but not a lot of them interest me, sadly. I have a lot of interest in these games, but I, they're just, it's almost like I don't want to start another game without, you know, finishing the, the last one that I was working on. So I have almost all the Assassin's Creed uh, games. I have Valhalla, which I really want to play, but I decided to go back to the, I was playing Odyssey, and then I got a bunch of the other ones. So I'm like, you know what, I'm going to start from the beginning. So I went back to the uh, Assassin's Creed 3 remastered. And then I got stuck and I haven't gone back to it. So that means that I can't even, I don't even want to touch the other ones until I do that one. I was doing uh, Far Cry New Dawn. Then I realized, oh, this is the, the sequel. Sequel? And this is like the continuation of 5. So I went back to 5 and, you know, I've been, I've been grinding on that one on my Spanish channel. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, uh, to be honest, I don't understand how people complain there's uh, there's not enough games on Stadia. There's too many games. I, you know, I guess now I'm like on Netflix. I spend more time looking at what games I have than playing those games. So now imagine now, uh, when Netflix starts having <laughs> games on there. Or if I had, you know, Amazon, Luna, or GFN. Like there's 118 free-to-play games on a GFN. And when I jump in there, the only thing I want to do is just flip from game to game to game and to see, uh, see which ones are my favorites.